Alright everybody, you thought it was all over, didn't you? But it's not. In today's video we're going to continue with the reaction to the last game, which was the 2015 NFC Championship game between the Packers and the Seahawks. Today I'm supporting the Seahawks because they won. I also support the Packers, of course, but today's video, uh, we're actually going to continue in the fashion of the last one and we're not going to watch the game, we've reacted to that, I know what happened, but what I want to see is what true fans, true Packers fans and Seahawks fans, <laughs> I want to see how they reacted to the game. Okay, so I found this video, it's from January 19th, 2015, it's got 7,000 views and it's called the 2015 NFC Championship Game Seahawks vs Packers Fan Reaction Compilation. We're in the business of doing reactions here. And I want to see some true fan reactions, okay? Look, let's just get into this, man. This is going to be either heartbreaking or hilarious. What a game. What a game. <laughs> and that was nothing compared to the next game, which was the Super Bowl. I mean, for Seahawks fans, the ups and downs of that season would have been, you know, almost too much to bear. And with that being said, let's get into it. Hold on. Shotgun for Capital takes the snap. Looks, fires near side, going for the end zone. Oh, he's coming after it. Is it picked up? Just ecstatic, isn't it? It's true fandom. Oh, oh and I can God. relate. Oh my God. <laughs> We're going to the Super Bowl, baby! So that was the year before, and they actually won that Super Bowl against the Broncos. Now we're the year after. So I've just reacted to this video in the last video, okay? So right now I'm going to splice in my reaction to that play. And then we're going to watch the fans' reactions, okay? Just for fun. Okay, so here's mine. And here's the fans. We're focusing on Seahawks fans. I was hoping to see some Packers fans react. <laughs> Something's just hit me. In the previous, in one of my previous videos, I was watching Pat McAfee um, talk to Marshawn Lynch, and he was saying, you know, if things had gone your way in that second Super Bowl and you had a one, the Seahawks were on, on the way to being a real dynasty team. And that's true. If they had won two in a row, the Legion of Boom, Marshawn Lynch, who knows? The benefit of hindsight. home too. <laughs> Look at it. Far out man. Oh. Something you'd remember forever. Yeah. <laughs> 
sounds like Blink 182 or something. The twelfth man. The twelfth man's going crazy. Oh, watch this. Watch this. <laughs> That's where I'd like to be. In a sports bar. I love it. Everyone's got lynch tops on. I love that. That's for sure. They're all going to bring them back out for this weekend too. <laughs> Don't punch the TV man! Believe it, can they? <laughs> Cannot believe it. <laughs> but I was like that too, actually. That ball I did not expect to land. There was no fucking no no one in the backfield. No one expected no one to be in the backfield at all. But I guess when you got Marshawn Lynch as a threat to carry that ball. You want to cover him first, don't you, really? So, oh. Cam Chancellor. Unbelievable. The agony and ecstasy. Any of you guys watch UFC? After every major fight, they, they bring out an agony and ecstasy special, looking at uh, you know both sides of the, the coin after the result. And um, I mean, you just got to feel for Packers fans, don't you? <laughs> after, especially after seeing, oh my God, these guys are all watching the entire game thinking, nah, there's no chance we got this. They finally get back, overtime, win it. I mean, these reactions are just priceless. <laughs> Let's go, All these Super Bowl parties.
actually, come to think of it, DK Metcalf plays for the Seahawks, doesn't he? That's, that's like this, the person who I've seen do that the most. Fuck, this game this week's going to be huge. We've got Russell Wilson, we've got Michael Dixon, we've got DK Metcalf, we've got Marshawn Lynch. Oh, oh, it doesn't get any better than this. Imagine how special it would feel being an athlete knowing that you literally do have fans that are so into your sport and so passionate about it and you're the ones playing on that screen. I mean that is the draw, that's the draw, that's the crowd reactions is the, is the, the you know, it's, it's, you can certainly see how retired sports stars fall into a pit of depression because there's just no way to recreate that kind of adrenaline. There is no way. Oh no, this is Packers. Oh no. Oh no, we're at the Packers now. Oh shit. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Fuck. I better put this on. Just for this. <laughs> I was like, these guys don't look too happy. Why not? Oh, boys, 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 boys. Here we go. What did I say? The agony and the ecstasy. So, they, so we saw one Packers reaction, and now we're going to watch the rest of the game. Receivers to either side. Russell takes the snap, drops back. He's going to throw down the middle. He's got a man. The ball is caught. Touchdown. The game is over. The Seahawks are going back to the Super Bowl in Glendale. What a catch in the end zone. I have seen this guys, so I'm going to skip it. If, if you want to see my full reaction, definitely watch the last video. But, um, yeah, let's keep... Oh no, is that the, is that the guy that, that caught the ball? Oh my god, because this guy, this guy that caught that game winning reception, had gone 0 for 4 with four interceptions. And then he goes and grabs that. All right, let's listen. Curse, how does it, uh, what were you looking for on that route? Hey, I know I didn't make all my plays, but when they count, I make it. Is that a redemption oh, touchdown oh, for you? Oh, 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 oh. And guys, we'll get that back to you. There is a crowd of people. That was Russell Wilson's voice that you heard coming in. Telling Jermaine Curse he loved him. And that's, that's the key for what this yeah. football team exactly. is all about the second half. They love each other and they're playing for one another. And Jermaine Curse, as he tried to say, even though he's more emotional, I didn't make all my plays today. I made some boo boos, but I came out with the biggest play when I needed to make it. And what a legend he is. And what legends all of you guys are. Okay, guys, <clears throat> that, was, that was actually a heap of fun. And that's what this channel's all about, you know, it's not... <sighs> Fuck. Thinking back, I started this channel to teach people how to drop kick a ball. <laughs> to teach people how to punt a ball. My two first videos, how to drop kick a ball in rugby. How to punt a ball in rugby. Late 2012, guys. We're here, it's late 2019. That's seven years later. And I'm still doing it. I'm still loving it. I just want to say thanks for being here, I really do. Um, you know, it's Christmas time, it's the festive season. 
it's Super Bowl time, it's playoffs time, and don't we all love that? So with all that being said, guys, I hope you have a fantastic festive season. I've said that in the, I've said that in the end of a lot of my videos recently, but you know the truth is, uh, the truth is, if you're listening to this, I'm actually going back to New Zealand for New Year's Eve. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to make or shoot a whole lot of videos before I head back, so then I can edit them whilst I'm away and put them up for you guys to enjoy. And I really hope you do. So with all that being said, guys, at the very least, please give us a like. Subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. I swear I like your style. Put you in Chanel because it's just perfect for your smile. Girl, I swear for you, I run the world, I run the mile. The way you look at me, I think I'm going insane.